all right uh, welcome back again to my youtube channel i decided to switch to color draw s3 so first of all i want to teach the basic tools in color draw s3 so first this place now is called the the tools bar then here is called the menu bar so over the menu bar we have file over to this file we have new this is used to create new documents just like this one that is showing here then here is new new from template this is when you con when you are connected to the when you are connected to online then this one is open when you want to open to already saved file that is in your system then this one is close if you want to close what you have done before or if you want to close your collateral totally then this one is close or the same thing then this one is when you want to save you can use ctrl x to save save as the same thing then here is acquire if you want to scan something you come here and acquire it you connect your scan scanning machine you scan then here is import if you want to import anything come over to import and import it then we have also sent to but all these things are not active now so we have bluetooth file comply zip folder desktop create short and so on so here is print ctrl p if you want to print anything print this is print merge create large merge files also we have print setup when you want to print you set the sizes of what you want to print the same thing here publish to to the web all these ones are connected to the internet then here is where your files your information document information are showing then this, this is exit if you want to exit totally alternate cross f4 then we come over to edit here we have undo ctrl z if you want to undo what you have done before redo you want to redo it ctrl plus shift plus z do it repeat this one is cut when you want to delete something you cut it this one is copy you copy it or you duplicate it this is paste you paste with ctrl v this is paste special the same thing this is delete when you want to delete something here is symbols if you come over to this place you see many many symbols that you can work with here the same thing here duplicate is also the same thing with copy then this is clone no so over here select all when you want to select objects or you want to highlight something you click here find and replace you find and replace objects here then this is barcode when you want to create barcode click on barcode but it's not active now because but if you want to create barcode come over to this barcode and create it all right let's go over to view uh, this view we have simple wireframe wireframe draft normal enhance enhance art over print all those things this one is your lula bar this is the lula bar here this is the lula bar just you see the lula bar moving it okay then over to the view again we have enhance and you know, all these things are minor minor tools so we are going to be treating the major tool that is in collateral s3 then we go to layout we have insert page we have rename delete page go to page switch page orientation page setup and the page background all these things are tools in collateral s3 but as we are going on we know the uses of all these things this is transform we have position rotate scale skies skill and so on and so forth align so all these, all these things are not active now because we are not working with it so we have order if you want to go to order to to front of page to back of page and, and so on then if you want to group something here is where you come and group it ungroup ungroup or combine break apart lock objects unlock 
unlock our object this is shaping all these things you will see the work when we start working with it this is word trim intercept simplify font minus back and the back minus one to find the things this is come come back to curve you can use control key to do that then also we have effect this is very important in color s3 we have effects over to effect we have okay effect we have adjust con construct enhancement to look at equalization simple slash target balance tune curve all these things you see the work of it when we start working this is color color balance gamma hue you no know, selective color replace color desaturate and so on transform these are also tools in color s3 here is power clip if you want to power clip something inside inside first of all you have to double click like this to select here is it if you want to power clip something let me power clip a shape inside this thing now so you understand what i'm saying when you want to power clip you right click and drag come over to this place and leave it click Okay. Right click and drag. Come over to you see power clip inside. The thing has been power clipped inside. You edit the power clip. You see it is it's inside the edit power clip. After working, you click on finish editing object to close. So over to bitmap, we have combat to bitmap. This is what when you want to do anything that has to do with bitmap. They have mode all these things are not active but believe me as we are going on we know the work of all these things we have text over here we we see many many things here we have fit to page this is when you want to light something inside a circle the text inside a circle use fit text to parts and do it this is change case use you also get to know all these things this is tools here is where you will see all the tools that you work with here also here is window this is where you will insert some tools that you will use this is tools bar you see it many bar status bar standard bar property bar tools bar text bar zoom internet and so on this is help when you want to go online to check some things come over to this help all right then this is the tools bar as i said before this is the pick tool after picking anything here you come over to this pick tool and release your Working this thing, Ali. Kusa. Then this is the shape too. You see, if you want to create any shape, you come over to this place. You see, click on it. If you want to add, you click on convert to curve like this. It will convert. You double add a node again. Click to curve. You start creating. Okay. Start creating anything you want to create, just like this. Alright, we go to your picture again and release it. Then over here we have crop to if you want to crop something after doing it, right click and it is a crop. Alright, this is also zoom to if you want to zoom, you see, you are zooming in, zooming out. If you want to zoom in, zoom in. Alright, here we have free hand tools. Over here we have a lot of tools here. Free hand to use BSA to Alistic Media to we have pen to poly polyline to and so on. This is pen to if you want to create any line, you can use pen to to create it. Here we have smart fill. If you want to fill anything, let's bring back our working space so that you understand. Alright, so you want to fill, fill in this color, you see, you want to fill it with black, you fill it, you want to fill it with blue, you fill it, that is the work of it. Then this is the rectangle tool, rectangle, you want to bring in rectangle tools, you got your rectangle tools and bring it. Inside this rectangle tool we have also three point uh, this rectangle to then over here we have ellipse two inside here we have one, one and this one three three point ellipse two 
this is when you want to create circle if you want to create a, a lounge circle click on your shift and drag or your control and drag you see here you get a lounge circle like this all right remember if you are new to my channel subscribe to my youtube channel like i stayed before i decided to switch to color draw so that i will carry every one along because some people are saying that they prefer using laptop which is color draw to design so i decided to be teaching color draw this time around so i have to teach the basic tools that is in color draw st before i will go on with my tutorials all right here is polygon 2 inside this polygon 2 we have this polygon to we have star we want to create star you come over to this after bringing this you come over to this release your this thing click on this star you see the properties here you want to add it you click on this six seven eight continue clicking till you you get to your desired shape that's it then here we have this compressed star it's also the same thing with that one but this one is different if you want to add you add 10 11 12 and so on mm -hmm. so again we have this graphics paper if you, if you are doing acts you want to do anything concerning art you use this your graphic paper to, to do it then you delete so last on this is spiller to this is used to create spiller shape just like this okay then over here we have basic tools under it we have basic shape which is this over here come over click on this thing you see the many other shape here that you can work with you see it then again we have this hollow shape when you want to create anything hollow also come over to this place you see other many shape that you can work with then here we have flower chart shape same thing here come over to this place and see many other shape that you can work with that's it so here is text if you want to write anything you start your text just like this just pack your text like this this is it you click on letter you start editing that's it then over here we have the first one here is interactive blend to interactive contour to interactive desktop to interactive drop shadow to is used to add shadow to your text or your image here is interactive envelope too you also see all the work of all these things as we are going on then here is interactive transparency too you want to add transparency to anything you see you click on this one you add yellow you click on this place you add black that's it then here is envelope too it is used to add color to your work then we have a try a try pen boss dialog click inside you see where you add color see many colors here corners we have this we have line caps after adding you click ok so again we have this is our trying color dialog is used to add color to your trying this is to remove our trying totally I'll try head these are the head the thickness of the outlines are here then here we have few tools it's used to feel feeling you select click ok it will feel just like this then click ok then lastly here is interactive field too this is also important and you want to add just like this just like this all right remember 
or every tools here has its own properties it's when you click on it that you see the properties that are involved just like this text tool now when you click on text tool you see bold it italicized on the line over here we have none when you want to justify anything this is alignment none left center light the full justify and the font justify so this is where your font is when you want to add font to your text this is where you come you see you have a lot of font here as we are going on you will be seeing them that's it all right i think i have touched the visual tools that are in Coradro s3 so if you find this video interesting please do share it with your friends who are also into graphic designing make sure you subscribe to my youtube channel click on the subscribe button notification bell also so that you don't miss my video whenever i post a video thank you